<laughs> no, what are you doing? Look up. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Hello, everyone. So, we are back. We have been away for a little while. Um, we've just been making the most of the end of the summer holidays. Olivia's gone back to school today, so we're all back to normal again. Um, and as you can see that Mo is still here. My last video, he was um, going to Algeria. And if you'd watched Mo's video, he would have explained that he didn't go in the end. So <laughs> we're back. We're back at the convent. And uh, we've been doing some stuff that we haven't showed you, just some little bits that needed to be finished that we'd already sort of filmed parts of it. So we're back in there today. Can I talk? No. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh yeah so that's what we're doing today and uh yeah we'll we'll go and show you inside the convent apartment because you haven't been in there for a while what did you want to say mo subscribe to just now. <laughs> yeah and also i've got something to show you because the kitchen um company got back to me and they sent me some 3d plans of what i asked for so I'm going to show you those as well. It oh. looks really good. And yeah, so it's going to be a quick one today. And uh, yeah, we are going to be doing daily daily videos. I know we said that before, but um, yeah, we need to get cracking and doing stuff in the apartment. And yeah, that's going to give us motivation to keep going. So yeah, come on, Mo. I'm coming. I'm here. <laughs> get up. <laughs> So we just stopped for lunch, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> we had lunch. And uh, we're back to work. And this one. It's been uh, it's been a long time I <laughs> didn't come. I forgot the the way to the apartment, sorry. <laughs> ah I can't get up the stairs. So, there's an also an update with the electricity, isn't there? No. Yes, there Not is. Yet. So, <laughs> we don't have electricity, no, but they came out. And this is a new box, it's called a Linky box, and they've put that. And then when they went to connect it, which is next door, yeah. in the apartment next door, they found two feeds, so two meters. Two meters for, there is two meters. Yeah. With this one, plus three for one apartment, yeah. which is not normal. You're supposed to just have one. Yes, and the... Uh, that day, uh, that electrician, he can't do nothing. Yeah. So we have somebody else who came uh, last... Uh, he came last week. Yeah, last week, and he did that. Now, we just uh, waiting for a call to the n another electrician to come. Didn't he say they're coming on the 12th? On the 12th, yeah. Yeah, so they're coming, another electrician's come in on the 12th. Just to plug it and to... Put the fuses in that linky box. And then we will have electricity. Yeah. <laughs> so we've been doing everything by hand. The ceiling is done this side. I have just finished off today. Well, not finished it, but done this area. As you can see it was that colour before, so I just need to get up on a ladder and do the cutting in. And I've done that on all of the windows so far. We've done all of the cutting in around the ceiling and we've got a little bit of white paint on the, the pink, but that's not a problem. And yeah, so Mo is... Well, he has been sanding off the ceiling today because I tried to do it and I couldn't do it. It killed me arm. <laughs> and he's just put one more little bit to touch it up and that's done. And... <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying if uh, 
when, once we do the Yeah, because we're going to get floor. the flooring pretty much the same as this. We just wanted to see whether we can it's, uh, it's okay. shut the door with it. Have you moved it along? Huh? Check it like further that way. The door might be a bit wonky. Right, yeah. Yeah. No, it's uh, no, it's good. Yeah, it's but good. it's just the thing here. This. What is it? This because the door. Oh, it's got it some, some. It's got something, yeah, like to protect the flooring. To protect the floor and the. So it's not actually wood touching yeah. it. It's just some fabric. Okay. No, so it's uh, it's okay. We don't need to cut the door. Yeah, we were just worried about this door because it's a fire door. It's not as easy as just to cut the bottom off because it's got like, um, it's like a very heavy, thick wood and maybe some metal in there. Whereas these doors, they're fine because they're just little hollow doors. But yeah, so we have today got to finish painting the ceiling. As you can see, it's a bit patchy, but this side is all done, looking beautiful. Even this side is done. Look, <laughs> I was sanding this. Yeah. And I touched the. You touched the, the paint. Ceiling, yeah, with my head. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, um, paint shop's back open, so we can get the paint, and um, then what I'm going to do is this paint here. This Dulux, it's like one coat. It's really thick. And you buy it white, obviously, and we found out that you can take it to the Dulux counter and they will mix you the colour you want into that size paint. So a pot of that is 100 euros and a pot of little green paint, it would be five litres, no, yeah, five litres of little green is like 200 euros. Mm. So because... <laughs> this colour, I fell in love with that colour and we found it with little green, I used it. We're going to finish off using that paint and then we're going to save some money and use this stuff because it is really good paint, it's really thick. So that's the plan for that. So we received an email back from the kitchen company. They had been on holiday and now they're back and they've sent me an actual 3D images of the exact kitchen so when she came we told her the sizes the colors where we wanted it etc so i'm going to show you them now the pictures so i also want to show you the angles of which the images are because it's a little bit difficult to work out if you're not sure of the layout so the first picture is from this angle And the second picture is from this angle. This one. Yes. From here. So you can see the picture from this angle. And um, we're not sure actually because in the pictures she's put like an oven and a hole. We're not sure exactly which area on the island they're going to be yet, but she just put it just so you can see. And also in the picture she's put a fridge. That's not what we asked for. We've actually just done it to make it look more ki like a kitchen. Yeah. And the third uh, picture? The third picture is from this angle. I from think. this. Yeah. So this is the third picture. And it's from this angle. Also in the picture we can see the, the door and the, the, the island here and the sink yeah. there. So the sink. We are going to have cupboards. She's put cupboards above it in the image so you can just sort of work out. We don't know what kind of cupboards we're having up there yet. So um, it is just all, it's not exactly how it's going to be, but it's pretty much there. Okay, okay. And the last picture. So you mean this picture? Okay, it's from this angle yeah so we can see the the windows and the, the door the bathroom door and the sink 
and we are adding to this kitchen. Mm. So the kitchen that you you can see in the picture is all we are buying as a kitchen. We are going to add to it, but not with. We're not going to have a, a kitchen made for those parts. What we're going to do, we're going to buy a big French double doored armoire, which is basically a wardrobe. Um, and we're gonna paint it the same color as the kitchen. And that is gonna sort of act as a larder cabinet. And we're gonna put it on this wall because the island is going to finish here in terms of length. So we have this space here to put a big cupboard. So that is a really good idea. It saves a lot of money because I can buy one of those for around 100 euros. Whereas if I buy the real kitchen cabinet that's actually they've made for me it's going to be like a thousand <laughs> so that saves a lot of money and then here on this wall where the fridge is in the picture we are going to put a um some sort of console table like a um, what is it called a buffet a buffet, buffet. Table. yeah so a buffet is traditionally one drawer and then it has covers above it but it comes in two parts i'm just going to have the bottom part so that can be used as a work surface as well just to put stuff on not really to chop and again paint it the same color so then that will give us a really full kitchen and lots of storage and space so that's the plan for the kitchen so now you can actually see it and visualize it it looks great i'm really happy with it Thank you.